Hey, what's going on everybody? I'm Noah from Techno Buffalo and this is the Tesla Model X just unveiled here at Tesla's Hawthorne Design Studio outside of Los Angeles. It's a seven-seater. Is it an SUV? Is it a minivan? Is it a CUV? Call it whatever you want to call it. It's a seven-seater all-electric vehicle, three rows of seating, front trunk, back trunk. They say it's quicker than a Porsche 911, has more room than an Audi Q7. The Model X crossover is built on the same basic platform as the Model S sedan, making it Tesla's third electric vehicle. The X will feature all-wheel drive powered by a unique dual motor system with one electric motor powering each of the front and rear axles. Guys, why don't we come right over here? Before we go any further, a note on those crazy doors. Tesla calls them Falcon doors, and believe it or not, they actually open up in really tight spaces, like parking garages where you're squashed next to the car on either side of you. In my all too short test ride from the back row of the Model X prototype, here at the launch event in Southern California, I was able to get a sense of the style, performance, and functionality that Tesla's promising with the Model X. The interior is similar to the one found in the Model S sedan, including the massive 17-inch touchscreen that serves as the center of the car's infotainment system. Tesla claims that the performance version of the Model X will get from 0 to 60 miles per hour in just 4.4 seconds. I definitely felt the instant torque of the electric motors and the acceleration as we did a short straightaway as part of the test course you see here. The car also showed off a smooth ride, tight handling, and minimal body roll for a vehicle of its size. The minimal body roll is attributable in part to the placement of the battery pack underneath the floorboards of the car. That placement also lets Tesla open up both the front and rear trunks for cargo space. This thing really can haul seven and their luggage. Now something about that seven-seater configuration. Like I said, I was in the way back. There are two bucket seats back there, and honestly, I think if there had been a second passenger next to me, especially one of my size, I might have felt a little bit too cozy for a long road trip. This car might be better suited to five adults and two kids, but then again, this is still just a prototype. Also, I had a tough time getting in and out of that rear seat, but Tesla said that the second row in the production vehicles will slide forward and backwards to aid in ingress and egress from the third row. It's fancy talk for getting in and out. This prototype, the second row seats didn't move. The Model X will go into production in 2013 with mass delivery scheduled for 2014, and pricing is said to start around the same price point as the Model S sedan, right around $50,000 after federal tax credits. Much, much more on the Tesla Model X on technobuffalo.com.